What's up guys? Welcome back to another diesel dog video. Now, if you've been following me for a while, then you know I kind of like to do these boot reviews. And some of you guys are interested in what I'm wearing on my feet at work, in the shop, working on trucks, and some of the stuff I wear on the weekends and stuff. Durability test. So some of you guys have probably seen my one-year review and two-year review on these thorough goods, but I made it three years on these bad boys. And it's actually been a few months since I retired them from work. Um, I still was wearing them on the weekends and stuff up until this sole started coming off. And we'll get into that. But yeah, three years wearing these in a shop environment. And well worth the money. These are the Thoroughgood 8-inch top, round toe, uh, steel toe, work boots. And... Probably my favorite pair of boots I've had in a long time. I cannot complain with how good these held up and how comfortable they were. And I've, I've said in every single review that I absolutely love these boots. Um, the only downfall for me was they were lace. They're good and you can put them on and get them as tight as you want and adjust for, you know, socks, thickness and stuff. But a little tedious trying to take them on and off a few times a day i put them on in the morning then i change at work and then i change again to come home and then i take them back off when i get home eventually so having an eight inch top tying them all all those times it does get a little tedious i found myself wishing i had pull up pull on boots again uh but the comfort and durability of these things far surpassed the need for just wanting to get rid of them just to get uh some pull up boots uh, anywho, just a quick review. I'm going to keep it short. I mean, like I said, three years. The soles lasted pretty good. This is what they look like. Everyone's experience with different brands of boots is going to vary. I'm a little bit smaller guy. I'm like 5'8", 5'9", 160 pounds. Someone who's over six foot and weighs over, you know, 250 or whatever might wear these out a lot faster than I did and uh you know different shop environments for whatever reason i was able to get three years out of these things i will say they were pretty they were getting to the end of their time i probably could have retired them a little sooner but i was so close i'm like i'm getting three years out of these bad boys for sure and they held up uh like i said the only reason i'm really retiring them now is because the sole has started coming off the glue whatever uh is starting to come off but it is a good year welt i can send these in to thorgood and they will resold them for me and that's kind of where i need your help i want you guys to let me know down in the comments what you think should i just retire these things and move on or do you think i should send these in i think it's like 150 bucks for the full like uh cleaning resole everything through Thoroughgood and do a video on that. Or do you think I should just retire them? I mean, I, I, the leather's still good. Somehow I did not wear through the toe on my left toe. Every single pair of boots I ever have, I always wear through the left toe because that's the, I always kneel on my left leg. The left knee and every single pair of jeans wears through and then the left toe eventually will wear through on my boots. And somehow these held up pretty good. I'm surprised. So that's a testament to the old thorough goods. I love the leather on these things. You can see what the color it kind of originally was that lighter kind of orangish uh, brown and years of working. I mean, they're that color now. I've never washed these things once, never oiled them. I just, I wear them and however long they last, they last. They're like 250 bucks off the shelf. Well worth the money. You get three years out of a pair of boots. That's, that's, that's pretty good. And about six months ago, I retired them from work and I got another pair of Ariats. Uh, some of you have seen my other boot reviews on my other pair of Ariats. I got, I love those boots. So, um, there's a couple different reasons I decided to go with Ariat. I'm going to do a six month review on those and kind of get into that. This is just about the thorough goods. 
Um, just to let you know that I did get three years out of these things. I've seen where some guys are complaining that they're not even getting a year and that's a bummer. You know, hopefully their um, quality isn't going down. I got, maybe I got lucky in these boots. I do like the mock toes a little more than the round toe. I just think they're a little more stylish and I like the way they look with like a pair of jeans and whatnot. But uh, I like the round toe too. I mean, they don't look too bad. They just, these things are so tattered up. I'd love to see what these look like resold. So. Let me know in the comments what you think. Is it even worth it? Has anyone had any ex experience with uh, resoling through Thoroughgood? Any luck? Do they come back all weird feeling or anything? I don't know. I've never had a, a pair of boots resold, so I'd like to. I'm really curious. So let me know down in the comments. Uh, third pair of laces in these things. I got like a pair of laces per year, basically. Um, I do want to save the lace keepers off these things i've had those on there for so long those held up and swap them over to another pair of boots maybe my red wings or something my red wing iron rangers i don't know uh, but yeah that is my final thorough good three-year review uh, in this form you know if we resell them we'll go down that road but yeah sad to see them uh, break apart like they are finally but they did me solid. These were some good freaking work boots in the shop. So let me know, guys, what you think I should do with these things. Stay tuned for the Ariat six-month review, and I'll see you guys in the next video.